these functions tell us a lot about your emotions and the way you're feeling inside. Now, if we can monitor these functions, we can begin to determine what you're feeling. We're mainly interested in the emotion of thrill. Thrill is that fantastic feeling of euphoria you get when you experience a rapid and large increase in a combination of pleasure and arousal, usually in response to some unusual stimulation. And because it's a big change, there's a good chance we can monitor it. But thrilling stimulation is often accompanied by an element of danger and risk. If you feel the risk has become too great, you'll start to become scared with high arousal and high displeasure. Risk is the thin line we tread when looking for maximum thrills. We're conducting experiments to help us design rides of tomorrow. Rides that can automatically adapt to human emotions. We're inviting members of the audience to operate the ride based on the live medical data that's streaming from the riders. is fitted with an electrocardiogram or ECG sensor to monitor heart rate and a helmet face cam to monitor facial expressions. Both sets of data are streamed live and wirelessly to the operator's monitor. The next step is to try and automate the ride, replacing the human with a computer to make the ride control decisions. Would you like to take a ride? The experience of controlling someone is really exciting in a way. I mean, I was a bit scared of hurting him, even though I knew I, it, he volunteered and it, it couldn't happen. Um, but no, it was great. It was very, uh, it's not something you get to do every day. Um, yeah, it was quite fun to do, especially just to see that uh, when you're really um, pushing her to a limit, that you see the facial expressions and uh, yeah. Uh, whether a computer could control the excitement, I'm not sure, but maybe. And I think, frankly, yeah, it is a bit scary. I mean, we trust computers to fly us across uh, the oceans in aircraft, but do we necessarily trust them to control uh, amusement parks and theme park rides? And uh, I don't think so. So probably that fear of the computer controlling it would add, you know, it would heighten the, the scary, you know, adrenaline-fueled impact of the ride. 